Pinterest school girl is because she's just like this girl in my mind so I didn't want to confuse you guys. She's kind of like the little sister of that girl, only they rely on academic validation. They always carry everything they need in their backpack and they're the ones that always try to look good for school. And of course their room is their comfort place so it's decorated with everything they like. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're not new here and if you're not, what? Guys, I'm only 20 years old and my whole body is aching so bad right now. The past few weeks, my morning routine has just completely been ruined because I've been going to bed very late at night, which has honestly not been the best. So in this video, I'm gonna try to fix that up and try to get back into my routine and also show you guys some ways to romanticize your life as like the school girl, like the Pinterest school girl, as I mentioned in the intro. roller on my skin because I tend to get really puffy in the mornings and after showers when your pores are all opened up this is really good to just close it back up and to tighten your skin I got this moisturizer from my friend because her family started a business Starting this month, I really want to start getting into the habit of cleaning my room before I go to school every day. Dad attached these bubble wraps on my windows because this room is like the coldest room in the house. So it's just there to prevent the cold air from seeping in. Okay, so time to actually get ready for school now. I'm going to be showing you guys my everyday daily school makeup routine. Um, this is what I do on a daily basis. I like to use a cushion foundation because it's just a lot more convenient and less time consuming because it comes with the puff so you just like just punch your face. And so it usually only takes me like a few minutes maximum. And then I use the Glossier concealer that looks like this. I just go under my eyes because it's a lot more moisturizing with this product. And then with a concealer that's meant to conceal blemishes, I'm using the one from NARS. Um, I like to just conceal my acne spots with this. So this semester, I have five courses. Last semester, I only took four and I've noticed that it was very easy and I thought that I could handle five. And I am handling five pretty well, I think. I used the lighter shade everywhere and then I used the darker one only for the end. I've been going out a lot more this semester as well. So if I had to choose between the fall semester and the winter semester, even though I hate winter, which is quite funny because I literally live in Canada. As a Canadian, I shouldn't be this big of a winter hater, but I am. I'm definitely like a spring or a fall person. Um, I don't like summer either, but I do love tropical places. Um, where am I even going with this? But if I had to choose between the fall and the winter semester, I would choose the winter semester because even though I love fall, last semester was quite boring because the first semester back I was still adjusting but now I feel like I've settled down a lot more. I hate winter and I hate like really humid hot summers. So when I go back to Korea this summer, I already booked my flight ticket so I'm really excited for that. But I'm not gonna be staying in July and August because the summers there are just way too humid and I just can't handle it. Why do I feel like I look so ugly with this camera? I feel like because the Canon G7X was like a vlogging camera, it made people look good. For my lip color, I love to use this one from Unleashia. Um, it's a very My Lips But Better shade. I love peachy corals and this is the perfect peachy coral shade for me because it's like toned down. I like to mix this with my lip balm so it looks more glossier on the lips. See, it's so natural, perfect for school. So this is how my eyelashes and my eyeliner looks. I'm just going to be applying a little bit of mascara on the roots so it blends in more naturally with my natural lashes. And my nose is very short and small, so I like to elongate it, which might sound crazy to some people, but don't contour the bottom here, but contour here, so it creates a shadow. It's crazy how insecurities are like, a natural human trait. It's so natural and I know a lot of people that stress over their insecurities, but 
just if you just realize that like literally everyone has insecurities and it's such a natural human thing to have because we're built to compare ourselves in this generation you might blame yourself less so just understand that everyone has insecurities people with smaller noses might look at people with bigger noses and feel jealous or people with bigger noses might look at people with smaller noses and feel jealous like it goes both ways with everything so right now i already have my vivian westwood necklace on this is the watch and the bracelet that i wear every single day this one is from tiffany and co this one is from coach for my hair i'm going to be doing a blowout hairstyle that's like very 90s i'm going to be using this blow drying hairbrush from revlon it pretty much just blows hot air out adds volume and waves it's very loud bag that I'm going to be bringing to school. I just think it's like the perfect tote bag for the winter time. It's from the brand My Mom Made It. This is the completed look. I will see you guys at school. So I wanted to share some of my study tips with you guys because personally I'm the type of person that gets distracted very easily and if that is you this might help you a lot. So I really like to use the Pomodoro method where you study for 25 minutes and go on a break for 5 minutes and I realize that this really helps with my concentration. You will be showered with good fortune. So I'm at Ikea right now for this part of the video. I'm going to be picking up a few new furniture pieces for my room. This isn't like a room transformation video, so it's not going to be too crazy, but... God, this is the lamp that's been blowing up on TikTok. It's so cute! Hmm. Thank you! Hi guys, so I just got back home and I quickly just wanted to show you guys what I got before I start building these with my dad. Um, so I got this cabinet again. I actually have this already under my makeup vanity. One that I have right now, I've just put too many things in there and the weight of it has kind of crushed the metal. And then I got the chair that I showed you guys in the video, which I'm really excited about because this chair is like broken. And I got two of these mini shelves. I'm going to fast forward the parts where I'm building these. Oh, I can't answer. Whoa, perfect. <laughs> I want to put a bunch of Sony angels on this shelf, but my dad suggests to put Demon Slayer figures that he got me. You don't get that? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Now that I have extra storage, I'm going to be placing some other random things in here and be putting it away. This is so random, but my friend texted me out of nowhere asking me if I wanted to go snowboarding, so I said yes. So I guess this will be another additional part to the video, because I think that's also really important for our students. I just completely blew this half of my nail, what the heck?
Guys, it hasn't even been two hours since we snowboarded and my whole body is aching already. I'm not excited to wake up tomorrow, but I don't know if you guys can tell, but my skin has been extremely dry for the past couple of weeks. Um, it's not even dry. Like, I actually had a chemical burn, something that I used. I don't know what it is. Recently, I received quite a few skincare PR. This one is from my friend's family, and our little card is so cute. Aww. I'm going to be doing like a little PR haul because I actually haven't looked too much into it because I've just been really busy with school and life. She sent me like this folder index kit which will be really cute to use at school. And this sticker pack. This one's so cute. I love the color. They pretty much sell a little bit of everything I think. You guys should definitely check them out if you guys like Korean skincare. She sent me a bunch of new skincare products and actually using the cream it hasn't been burning my skin which is good this one is a cleanser and this one is a balanced toner thank you so much sheena i'm gonna be using these very well and tell your parents thank you as well because these are really cute and i can't wait to use them next up we have a package from skin food um it's actually crazy to like receive products from like korean brands because I grew up with these brands, you know? Like, I remember being like six, no, maybe not six, nine, ten, like going to Korea over the summer and like begging my mom to get me stuff from brands like this, like Etude House, Clio. And now I'm getting PR packages from them. That's crazy. Comes with a little card. This is what it looks like. Every single one of their products is like made with real food. My mom is sleeping. If she wakes up, I'm literally gonna get killed. Okay, I think we're good. Um, these are like toner pads. I've never used them before, but I do know a lot of girls just like put them on their cheeks before they do their makeup, and it's supposed to just calm your skin down. Holy sh and then I got a carrot relief cream, water parsley silence serum. Oh my gosh, I feel like a real YouTuber right now. Carrot carotene moisture effector, and as well as the spatula. But thank you so much to Skin Food for sending me these products. I will be using every single one of them, I promise. I just split one in half because I didn't want to use two. Woke up at 11 o'clock, I ain't got no job, what the hell should I do today? This feel like some I don't give a fuck, oh my god, shut the fuck up, I ain't hearing what you gotta say What the deal, how you feel, not important All I'm thinking about is riding in these Porsches, but don't be 